So yesterday, uh, one of my seminary students asked a question. Yeah, I learned so much from them, you know. I heard the question this way. This is how I heard it. So, Jesus Christ was on the earth, full of love and light and power, full of love, just, mm. Why wasn't that enough for the people of that time? Why, I heard it. Why did it take so long? What, what, what's going on? Why didn't they get it? Why didn't they get this beautiful love all around them? And the student that asked is a cook. So Spirit gave me an analogy, which I loved. <laughs> they said, visualize egg whites in a dish, and visualize egg whites after they've been beaten and fluffed. And the egg whites that have been beaten are full of air, and they're bigger, and they look like a totally different animal. You can externally breathe on those egg whites in a dish, and they will not take the air inside. You know? You have to literally go within and beat and change the structure of the whites. Beat them, beat them, beat them, beat them, until they take on more air, more air, more air. And that is the difference between the message when it first came and where we are today. And they said, you can beat your egg whites through experiences. Hit me hard, hit me fast. Give me a tough one, God. Or you can whip those egg whites through spirit. Letting go control. And letting spirit bring greater and greater and greater and greater light into you. And it is a process. But we need to be allowing the... to come alive. So we can take more Christ into every thought that we have, so we can bring more of that Christ and awareness into every breath. And in those moments when we're feeling human carnal limited, just recognize it. And just breathe in. I'm going to breathe greater Christ into my body. I'm going to ask my higher self to be fully present in my body. So I can hold a higher frequency. And when I do, that which seems to be an obstacle now will bow before me. But that's not why we're doing it. We're doing it for spirit. Everybody breathe. How do you feel? Fabulous. <laughs> you feel ready to take some more in? Yeah. Alright, let's put our feet on the floor. <coughs> I want you just to feel a beautiful column of light come over you and just feel that you are so loved. You are the beloved child of God. Just feel light pouring through you. Feel that you are safe in God's love. And as you breathe, feel the light pouring into your body. Just imagine it like a beautiful river of energy going into the cells. And now I ask that your higher self become fully present in your body. And don't resist, just allow it. And breathe. I ask that my higher self be fully present in my body. And for some, it may feel like a subtle change. For some, it feels like another layer of liquid coming through. For some, you'll feel expanded energy moving into the body and expanding the boundaries of the cells. However you feel it is perfectly fine for you. But notice the difference. I ask that my higher self become fully present in my body. And I want you to be aware the higher self meets you where you are, no matter where you are. So breathe and feel the beautiful column of light. And let's lift up. Imagine your angels can lift you up that column of light into a higher realm of consciousness. Just imagine yourself being lifted up into a beautiful cloud, a beautiful celestial frequency of love. Feel your heart opening. And I want you to invite the presence of Jesus Christ just to stand before you. He 
teacher, elder brother, Christ. Whatever word fits your heart, look into his eyes and feel the love. In this moment, you are in his kingdom. You are in the kingdom of spirit. Let this kingdom fill you. And put your hand out and touch the Christ. And ask, teach me how to be the light while I do that which is mine to do. Teach me how to remember I am spirit while I create this space of heaven on earth. And feel the inspiration pouring into you. You may hear words. You may just feel energy. But feel the love. Breathe and just let your vision go all around you as you stand in this cloud and see the fullness of this space. Let your vision open to see all the beings of love and light that live in this beautiful spiritual kingdom. And then take a moment to look at your little life below and realize how important that little life is. Through you, much is done. Through you, love flows. Feel the angelic and spiritual kingdom supporting that life of yours. Those who seek to find their life through following spirit will find their life. Feel the love. Take a breath and just gently let your spirit come back into the chair where you sit, back into your body. But before you open your eyes, just feel your heart center. Father, Mother, God, we seek to create on this earth plane a kingdom of spirit. Use us as channels of divine expression and divine love. And thy will will be done. And so let's take a breath. You feel fluffier? <laughs> As you walk this week, breathe it in and see yourself expanding. Let the little visual be at your forefront. Spirit is simply fluffing me into a greater and greater expression of Christ. And so it's...